Hey everybody, uh, I wanted to come on really quick for a quick happy mail and vlog. Um, I got some happy mail from Victor from Ukraine and he sent me this really great handmade card. Look at that. For a guy who I know who I've talked to who has limited supplies, he sure does make cute stuff. Um, so it looks like it's just made out of regular paper, some repurposed materials, an old map, a doodle. I just love it. And then he included an ATC card that says Just Autumn. It's fabulous. I love it. So there's that. Thank you so much, Victor. I really love it. And a great envelope to add to my stash because I'm still collecting envelopes for that envelope junk journal that I saw somebody else make I think on junk journal junkies and now I've got to make one I was cutting up your happy mail envelopes and using bits and pieces of them in my journals and I should have been saving them because I yeah anyway <sighs> hindsight's always 2020 right so I got another packing package from my friend Cindy Utter from New York and I knew she was sending me something uh, in particular, she told me she had an extra one of these handmade watercolor books from Hobby Lobby because uh, I told her I was going to go buy one and she said, don't, I have one, I'll send it to you. Thank you so much. And I haven't even opened it yet because I wanted to do that on camera with you guys. I can't wait. I keep hearing such good things about these journals. Oh, and I can just tell you by just feeling the cover, I'm already in love with it. Let's see if I can get this open without ripping the label. Or at least without ripping it too much. Okay, there we go. Oh, the cover is made out of handmade paper, as are the pages inside. Oh, and I gotta tell you guys, you know I like my watercolor paper textured. I don't like smooth watercolor paper. And this is just wonderfully textured. It feels like cotton. What is it? Probably, it's 100% post-consumer waste. So it's a recycled watercolor paper journal. I love that. And it's a stitch bound. It's fabulous, fabulous, fabulous. Yay, can't wait to work in it. And then what I didn't expect was she included a bunch of extra things, which I didn't expect. Um, she got some of these really great tags. Oh, these are from her husband has a firearms business and these are some of the tags from his firearms business I think he's closing up shop um, anyway and she got these really great paper clips I think they're supposed to be alligators but she sent me a bunch of these tags with look at the clips the clips are cool so she sent me a whole bunch of them I didn't expect that thank you so much we I know we talked about them but and then she sent me some really fun bits and pieces of um, textured paper. And these are like corrugated cardboard. They're going to be great on the jelly plate. And then she sent me some cork paper. Really cool cork paper. Look at this one. I like that one. And then some burlap paper. I just want to, you know, rub on it. I know it'll make me itchy later, but... <laughs> Um, and then she had gone to the Mutter Museum, which is one of those museums of medical curiosities, and she picked up a, a, a brochure with this interesting drawing on it that she sent me a copy of to use. Is that cool or what? And then she put a note on another tag. Oh, I didn't even see the back side! on another one of the, the firearms tags and she's decorated this one with some of her painty doodled paper. Look at that. Love it. Thank you so much. Uh, I love all the bits and pieces that you sent Cindy and Victor. I love it, love it, love it. And I can't wait to work in that journal. What else is going on today? My camera's doing weird things today. So hopefully it's recording okay and it'll download okay. I don't know, it was doing something weird. I might need a new SD card. How long are they supposed to last? <laughs> I Oh, I um, created a new page on my website, GinaBAarons.com. The link for it should be in the description below. Today is, what's today? The 18th of September. And I was looking that way because the calendar's up there. Um, 
that is called inspiration photos or inspiration pictures, something like that. So pictures I've taken, um, and in some cases I took them and I've altered them in an app, but they're all photos I personally have taken, um, are on that page and they're free for you to download and use as inspiration in your artwork. Um, some of them you will see in upcoming videos on my YouTube channel. I'll be using the photos. Some uh, in Watercolor Wednesday, some in Monday with Deco Art. So, that being said, as of the 18th, the page is up. I don't know if anybody's noticed yet, but it's up. Yay, yay, yay. I think that's it right now. I think, maybe. I don't know. Maybe? All right. So don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and uh, you know, tell your friends about my channel. <laughs> um, if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, um, please feel free to contact me. All my information is in the description below, and of course, leave a comment on the video. I do respond to them within a day or two. Um, I'm trying really hard to be better at that because it used to take me a week to respond to comments. Now I'm really trying hard. Like every evening uh, after dinner, I'm on the you know, one of the devices around the house, it's not like there's not plenty of them, uh, replying to comments. Um, if you have any um, products you'd like to send me to try and review, uh, my P.O. box is also in the description below. Of course, if you want to send me happy mail, <laughs> my address is down there. And um, I think that's it. Have a great week, weekend, day, whatever. I don't know for sure when this is going to air, so... Uh, but have a great something and don't forget to go out and do something nice for yourself because you deserve it. All right. I'll see you all later. Bye.